Well, Santa is making a list and checking it twice. He knows who's been naughty or nice. For many kiddos, though, they won't be able to see old St. Nick Kris Kringle or if you prefer him just to call him dear old Santa Claus at the mall this year. But don't fear, he's zooming in with us right now from the North Pole. Good morning, Santa. Oh. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Hey, you know what? Merry Christmas to you, Santa. Well, I have a question. I mean, obviously things are going to be very different. This whole year has been different and a lot of kids won't be able to see you in person to tell you what they really, really want for Christmas. So how are you making sure that the magic of Christmas never stops and still give kids the opportunity to speak to you directly? Well, it, uh, one of the things that you must know is that Santa knows everything. He's always watching. He sees you when you're sleeping. He sees you when you're awake. And I have the opportunity now, because of technology, to visit people via Chit Chat with Santa. See, I'm just happy that you also happen to watch Local 24, and that's how we got this connection. I could get this call straight to the North Pole. So That's right. Thanks. All right, Santa, because of the pandemic, I know you're going house to house. And we always like to leave out milk and cookies. I always leave out um, carrots for the reindeer. But what do you recommend uh, to be safe for, for kiddos as they put out a gift for you this year? Maybe just write you a note. What are you thinking? Well, I'm sure that everyone knows that Santa's favorite cookie is chocolate chip. And milk always goes good with, with cookies. But you know what else goes good with cookies, Prancer? Oh, that's me. What? <laughs> that's you. <laughs> it's chocolate. It's hot chocolate with marshmallows, of course. So hot chocolate. So you're good with it then. And you still want your cookies Absolutely. and milk. Absolutely. Okay. Love the hot chocolate. <laughs> Love it. Do you put marshmallows on yours? I do. I need all the details to make sure that I have completely marked off everything on my list. All right. There are four. You can million leave them right on top. I can stir them in. Perfect. All right, well, there are 4 million kids around the world. How do your elves make enough toys for everyone? Well, elves are very smart and they work very, very efficiently. They, do you know that elves also have to go to school? No, they, I didn't know that there's they an elf They have school? to learn their alphabet. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's my favorite joke. That's a good joke. That's a good one. <laughs> All right, well, I've already told you that I personally associate with Prancer, but you know, you don't have to answer with a bias, but do you have a favorite reindeer? Why, I certainly do. That fellow with the nose so bright, he's my favorite reindeer, but he's always in trouble. He's always letting the reindeer out of the pen and opening the gate. He's a mischievous little fella, but he is definitely my favorite. That's an acceptable answer. All right. Uh, well, I do just have a quick question for you um, here at Local 24. You have me, you have our morning anchors, Kelsey Cairns and John Paul, and I need to know who's on your naughty and who's on your nice list. Who's on the naughty and nice list? Mm -hmm. From me. Well, now and you should know interest. that just by how you behave. Well, I know. But Santa I'm always has to good. always check that list. <laughs> he has to keep checking that list. It's hard to be nice all the time, even for Santa. If I had to guess, John Paul's probably the only one on the naughty list. All right, now, how can we how can we connect with you on uh, Chit Chat? Absolutely, chitchatwithsanta.com. Visit the site there. There are several openings, and we're open 24-7 in terms of uh, the website. And uh, calls are available seven days a week. And we get to speak directly to Santa? Absolutely. Oh, you can goodness. speak to Santa. You can speak to Mrs. Claus. You can request a clause clip for children who are shy and don't want to speak directly to Santa or who want to just continue to visit with Santa several times before Christmas. Well, this is wonderful news. All right. Well, I'm going to text you my list later, Santa. I appreciate you taking some time to join us this morning. And you have a Merry Thank Christmas. You. All right. We'll be back after the break.